I talk to her, but I show him. You don't show him. Oh. <laughs> hey, I'm just, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I'm just Yo, what's poppin' guys? It's Cho, we're here with How To. It's your boy, Los Angeles, California, designer, self-taught, let's get it. What I'm about to teach you today, how to make a denim skirt out of some jeans. So we have to show off that these are jeans, you know? We have the belt loose, we have the little, we got the OG zipper, we got the button and everything, and we wanna bring those things back to life into the new piece. So, here are the jeans. And now we're about to get it cracking. Okay, so the first thing I like to do is deconstruct the original piece because we wanna to bring to life all those original elements. So I have to take off these bell loops. I'm gonna take off this entire waistband. Like on the inside, they have all these seams. I don't like to just cut it with scissors because I wanna reuse everything and make sure it's like A1 when I bring it back to life. So I'm gonna unstitch all these seams. I'm gonna bring back this life of this button, use this button. I'm gonna use the original zipper and everything. Right now I'm gonna take out all these seams. Sometimes you can catch a good rhythm. Um, it's like kind of a tedious process because then you also have to go clean it all up for when you redo it. Um, but yeah, so I'm gonna take all these apart and sometimes you can open it up. And since this is denim, it's strong so you can, you can kind of give it a good pull. So I'm gonna take it all the way off. Since I already know I'm making a skirt, I, it can live within the confines of what's already here, so I don't have to do that much deconstructing, but I want to use this waistband, so we're going to do that. What you can do is take those pattern pieces, trace them on some paper, now you have the pattern for these pants. And since you deconstructed it, you know exactly how to Resell it. Now there might be some things you don't know, but at least you know like in general how it can be put back together. Okay, so now I have my waistband. Okay, so I'm gonna I'm gonna sit here and I'm gonna take out all these little loose threads for when I resell that. I don't want those loose threads sitting around. And I might not have this same color thread when I resell it, so I wanna make sure all this like gold is gone. Okay, so this is what we have. We have our waistband. This is like the most important part when I'm making a skirt just so I can like reuse this waistband because I want to reuse this button. <laughs> um, and so since it's a skirt, it's a little smaller frame, I know I can probably just cut from these legs. So for example, if I cut, if I cut from this leg right here and I open up one side, now it's twice the size width and then I can cut my like body pattern from that. So. Um, and then we'll have the rest of this denim to play with later, or we can bring out other elements as we go. I'm just gonna use this denim. We're making a little mini guy, so it's eight, probably eight and a half, nine inches long, you know, it's for those good times. Ha <laughs> But okay, here we go. I'm gonna open these up. So I have my, my leg, right? You're like, wait, my body don't fit in that. So I'm gonna open up one of these seams. And I know this is gonna be like wider than the front panel and the back panel. So for efficiency's sake, we're just gonna just cut it. Okay, what I would normally do, instead of cutting this, I would unseam this, but that will take me 15 minutes each, 30 minutes, so you do the math. Now you can see that this is like longer than the width of a potential skirt front and back. So now I have my Panel one, panel two is right down here. Boom, to the boom. To make it even, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna take, there's both panels right here. I'm gonna fold it in half. Boom, to the boom, to the boom, to the boom. What I'm gonna do is make this cut for your uh, hip line. Can you see? I'm gonna go like this, just for your hip line right here. And since it's folded, we're gonna have both done right away in one cut. So, okay, we have all our pattern pieces cut out. We have our front panel, we have our back panel, we have our nice little hip line on the, the palms of my hands right here. We have our waistband. Now these jeans were maybe like a 32 inch jean, 
And I'm gonna measure this real quick to see like the width that we'll be working with. So we're gonna walk my ruler along this whole edge just to see 12 inches. So this is 12 inches in the front. Yeah. So the front panel is 12 inches and the back is 12 inches. So that's 24 inches. And let's say I do a quarter inch seam allowance. Now we're talking real sewing terms. Quarter inch seam allowance. So I have minus a quarter, minus a quarter, minus a quarter, minus a quarter. That's half, half, one inch. So that's 24 inches, but after I sew it all together, it'll be 23 inches. So here's the waistband. Like I said, it's about 32 inches. So on the back side, I have to take out nine inches. But then when I sew it together, quarter inch, quarter inch, I have to take out eight and a half inches. So now it's time to get it cracking. This is the fun part. So we have our panels. We want to make sure everything is, we're sewing it inside out. And that's where you can kind of get confused with sewing because you're like, wait, what's going on? But when you flip it to the right side, all that little ugliness is gone. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to sew up the side seam right here. I'm going to sew like this. Boom. I'm going to go backwards one time. So now it's locked in. So now I'm just gonna go right down this whole line all the way to the bottom. When I get to the bottom, I'm gonna double back on it so it's like locked, secured, ready to go, signed, sealed, delivered. Let's get it. Okay. And like I said, I'm making sure the sides of this fabric is matching up with the side of this foot. I'm not even looking at the needle. Now I'm sewing the other side. I'm gonna add my zipper in later. It'll be nice like that. Sorry. We're locked in. It's not coming apart. You feel me? I'm not gonna bring it all the way up. I'm gonna go about like halfway on this side because now I'm gonna add my zipper. But so I'm gonna go back and forth right here. And now we're locked in. She ain't going nowhere. So we're locked in. So we're gonna, we're gonna sew the waistband to the inside of the denim. You're like, wait, why is that? Why are we gonna do that? I'll show you in a second. I'm just gonna go a little brief first. So I'm gonna sew this in thicker fabrics and like rougher. You might need to change out your needle, but I think we have a nice size. I think we have like, a, I don't know, this one might be like 14, but you may or may need to like swap out your needle. Okay. So we have the, like the waistband, we're sewing it to the inside of the denim. And you're like, wait, why, where is it at? This is where the magic happens. We're gonna flip it over, and now we're gonna sew it on the top. I only did a little bit, but I'm just showing you. So it's gonna be like that. And so you can see this original seam right here from the inside. So we sewed the waistband to the inside of the skirt. And you see this seam here, but we're gonna flip out the waistband. When we flip it over, we're gonna hide this seam. Right here, we're gonna boom, right there. All the way around. So it's gonna look like that in the finish. You ready? Okay, so I just showed you how to, but we're here now with the final piece. This is the show off, this is where you flex, this is where you strut your shit, this is where you go crazy. So we're here with the skirt. What I did, I opened up this bottom seam just so it can give it that more wear of a look and you have this, this natural coloring from when they washed the original jeans. Boom, I added that OG zipper. You know how we doing it, everything's nice and clean, but we did leave a little raw action, you know. So we out of here, you know, we got the hip, the hip line, waistband going crazy. It's clean on the inside, clean on the outside. Chevy tuned up like a NASCAR piss stuff. Okay, so now that we've made it, we've showed it off to the world. You gotta see this boy live in action. So we're gonna, you know, we're gonna try to find some models or someone throw this on. We're gonna do the no, damn thing. y'all thank you for tuning in to how to with cho we made a skirt out of jeans i don't know what's next but make sure you tune in we got plenty more coming and make sure you tune in to upcycle nation
with your boy and Carucci, Jerome Lamar. We out of here.